everybody and welcome back. Today's video is a one that I get asked for all of the time and it is a what I eat in a day. Um, so as the video goes on I've got a lunch, a very quick lunch idea in there. I've got an excellent evening meal idea which I promise you you do not want to miss. Um, so it, this is basically a what I eat in a day and uh, I hope you enjoy it. The breakfast one for me is a little bit funny as you will see as you get into it and to be quite honest I have not had my breakfast at all. It's just one of those things when you take painkillers you either want breakfast or you don't and there is absolutely nothing wrong with not having breakfast. You know consuming calories for the sake of it just isn't you know you don't have to do that so you know you can have like a piece of fruit or if you don't fancy it or a banana or something like that but consuming calories just for the sake of it for me is a big big no-no so I try to listen to my appetite and as I say this morning it was just a complete write-off so we just didn't go there um, but anyway I hope you enjoy the videos coming up and if you like this kind of thing don't forget to subscribe to my channel give it the thumbs up and set your notifications because I'm going to move my Sunday loading time. I'm going to bring it forward. So enjoy the videos following. Morning, everybody. Um, this is the start of my morning. It is half four, something like half four, 20 to five, something like that. So breakfast. OK, this is where we are. I have to take this painkiller first and then these about an hour or so later. The problem is when I get up at this time of morning, I don't really want to eat anything. So it's a choice of which one of these I can get down me without sort of feeling sick before taking that. And that is every morning because this time of the morning, I just don't really want to face food. And sometimes I feel sick off the night before when I've took my last painkiller. Yeah, so mornings are a little bit of a challenge, but either way, one of these have got to be eaten. This is like half of my healthy extra B, and obviously that's just free food. So one of those is going to be like a pre-breakfast, and then sometimes I have breakfast and other times I don't. It just depends how I feel. <laughs>
you enjoyed the videos and I will do more in this sort of what I eat in the day. Um, I will also drop my website details in the description below and there there is lots of lunch ideas and evening meal ideas and slow cooker things and things like that if you're looking for a little bit of inspiration. Anyway, have a great Sunday everybody and I will back, back with you on Wednesday. Yeah, bye.